And a very good morning from Washington. It's Thursday, March 27th, 2014, and this is The Daily Rundown. I'm Kristen Welker, in for Chuck Todd, who will join us in just a minute from Vatican City. And that is where we begin with today's historic meeting between President Obama and Pope Francis. The president was greeted at the Vatican this morning by members of the iconic Swiss Guard after a slow and deliberate walk through the halls with dignitaries. The president arrived outside the papal library, where the pope greeted him in the small throne room. Photographers snapped their pictures when they were joined by translators for a private meeting. After their meeting, the president and the pope exchanged gifts. The pope gave the president a copy of his papal letter, The Joy of the Gospel, in which he calls for a church that is poor and for the poor. And the president offered this. These, I think, are carrots. So the, uh, each one has a different seed in it. The box is uh, made from timber from the first cathedral built in the United States. So, the, uh, if you have a church the White House, we can show you our garden. And it's not the first time President Obama has met with the head of the Roman Catholic Church. He sat down with Pope Benedict XVI in 2009. But President Obama, who has made income inequality the defining domestic issue of his second term, has talked about how he's been inspired by the People's Pope, who has captured the imagination of millions around the world with his commitment to fighting poverty. 